Hey, it's Marty here. With my submission to Quick Smoke's Checkpoint Build Challenge. So, while I give you a tour, our homie Preston here will keep a watch. So, we're at uh, Taffington Boathouse uh, for two reasons. Um, this is a Fallout 4 No Mods playthrough. Uh, based uh, loosely on the Minuteman run. Um, and the second reason is that it has a road going through it. I guess those two reasons are kind of uh, linked. Uh, because I, I have no mods, I can't just build anywhere in the Commonwealth. So this is the one of the few locations uh, that has an actual road going through it. Here's uh, here's one of my guards. He's outfitted with uh, combat armor and uh, I think it's a military uh, uniform. In the building here on the south side we have an armorer. Uh, it's a bit of a seating area. Uh, there's a couple of extra weapons there for people to help defend if need be. Uh, and uh, People sitting around can read a newspaper or watch uh, one of my Saturday morning cartoons or read a book or something. So uh, the armor has his workbench back here. Uh, yeah, okay, good to see the, the gasoline and the turpentine is not too close to the fire there. Although the fire is sitting on top of uh, wood, I'll have to get uh, somebody on that. And Probably uh, put a layer of sheet metal down underneath. Yeah, so he looks like he's working on a piece of uh, arm, arm armor. Uh, just to the east of the building here is the utilities, the power, and the water, water purification unit, and a uh, uh, nuclear power generator, I guess, something like that. And, uh, all right, so let's have a look, see here. There's a couple of bathrooms here, a couple of restrooms for passers-by. I believe there's even a, yeah, there's even a tub in each one, so. Oh, we got all the amenities. Awesome. So the armorer has a coffee pot on, and, uh, uh he's got a couple of things. Got a couple of things for sale here. And this is his sleeping quarters. Uh, geez, I wonder, is he working on that or researching it or what? I believe that's uh, Super Mutant Armor and Helmet there. Anyway. The, the south side here also has a um, kind of a an overlooking um, defense. This uh, Minuteman gentleman here uh, can see for quite a while down the road there towards Cambridge and uh, looks like he has a, a few grenades here that he could lob at any incoming hostiles and wait what oh yeah that's a that looks like an artillery artillery uh, call smoke grenade <laughs> Wow Couple of extra bullets there and an extra combat rifle. Not really sure I approve of uh, the drinking and uh, drinking on the job there, buddy. But anyway, I think you're not alone in that. All right, so let's go. Let's go further into the compound here and. Um, I'm trying to catch a dog in a trap over on the north side there, but I uh, haven't uh, had any luck yet. So uh, I guess when I do, he'll uh, he'll uh, end up in there, hopefully. A little area here for caravans and traders. Uh, when they do show up, they're uh, welcome to stop in and warm up and whatever. So this is the restaurant. Taffington Boathouse. It's got uh, 
Uh, it's fairly well equipped. Uh, here's my uh, my employee and her uh, her sleeping quarters are back there. So uh, oh yeah, and here's the little kitchenette thing. Some gas going on, and uh, the thing we got a fire uh, fire extinguisher going on there too. Awesome. At this point, you're probably wondering. Yeah, you guys are probably generating an awful lot of garbage, you know. And I guess my my uh, my my answer to that is this uh, this barge that we've deployed. Basically, it's sitting on a, a wooden peg, kind of anchor. Try to kind of fill it up, and uh, once a week we'll we'll give it a push out to the out to the lake there and. Uh, now before we do that, we'll uh, throw some gas in with the contents and set it on fire and then push it out and wait for the fire to die out and then pull it back in with a rope. I can't see the rope, it's uh, probably under all this stuff here. Yeah. Anyway. Garbage, not a problem. <laughs> hey, wait, what's this? Ah, uh, that's where they are. Okay. I thought I had... Uh, Oh yeah, okay, I see what's going on here. Sitting here with Preston last, uh, last evening, and, uh, I guess we had a little too many, and everything just kind of stayed behind there. Cigarettes and gold lighter and whatnot. Looks like, uh, somebody is about to put, uh, a piece of rad scorpion on the, uh, on the, on the queue there. Awesome. And we got an outdoor uh, patio kind of area too that people can sit at when it's uh, it's a little nicer out, like it is this evening. Awesome, good stuff. So over in the building here, we have some uh, employee quarters there, and on the north end we have our clinic. Our good doctors only. Uh, too happy to provide medical services so here's her uh, her sleeping quarters and if she should happen to have a patient that needs bed rest well they can obtain it right there and she of course has the requisite meds all kinds of stuff available here Maybe she even got a biometric scanner wow okay good for her <laughs> and of course the uh, the desk where she can do some research there, microscope and stuff. Typewriter for documentation. Good stuff. So, in the original building here, what we've done is um, we've uh, we've we've kind of turned it into the main bunkhouse. Did a little bit of a job on the roof there and uh, fixed up the bathroom a little bit. Not sure what's on to go with her. Probably dead drunk. A little early in the day there, lady, but anyway, regardless. I guess in this day and age, can't blame anybody for wanting to get loaded. So, again, a couple of extra weapons in case we get attacked. Uh, also install this espresso machine, which is espresso, S, S. Anyway, however you say it. Or, um, yeah, because it's good. <laughs> oh, look, my favorite game. Newspaper and our general store is off where the kitchen used to be in this building. Had a couple of things going on here. You know, some uh, tools and toys and stuff over there on this side and some drinks on the back wall there. And, um, and on this side, we got a couple of... Uh, couple of more food items and fishing rods in case uh, somebody wants to go and uh, try their luck trying to catch some two-headed fish or whatever <laughs> yeah, so this is my little uh, corner and this is where I spawn if I fast travel into this location yeah that little uh, laser weapon there Minuteman laser that probably should go into uh, into a museum too. That's where I got it actually at the uh, Concord Museum there. 
And there's my uh, my dog tags. I was wondering where they went. So here's the workbench. Workshop, workbench, whatever. And we got another guard standing up there, just keeping an eye on the courtyard here where all the food is getting grown. And got a trough there for the uh, two-headed cows. On the south side, we have another uh, kind of a guard station. All right, you're not going, buddy. All right, we'll try to get by you here. All right, so here again, we have Minute Man Presence. And she does all the documentation for um, comings and goings and takes pictures if necessary. And she got the same uh, kind of grenade basket there with a artillery smoke grenade and uh, some extra weapons got a phone there in case she needs to call down and get some extra help if needed and of course she has the uh, Minuteman power armor if things get a little rough well she can always put that on and of course her sleeping quarters are back here I don't think there's anything special to see back here so the we have another guard here on the ground i like to put uh these turrets in front of the guards just uh you know gives them an extra little uh peace of mind i guess so what's available at this uh at this checkpoint general store restaurant medical clinic the armor and some restrooms and again just similarly to what we got going on in the south side we got these, uh, this overhang over the entrance, and uh, we have another guard here in military outfit and combat armor, and lots of turrets, and well, isn't that good to see, right? Milk instead of booze. <laughs> and of course, she got a her allotment of grenades if she needs them. Yeah, so that's pretty much it for the Minuteman Taffington checkpoint. There's the uh, the dog trap I'm hoping to catch a dog in. So I hope you like the tour uh, as much as I like bringing it to you. Cheers and we'll catch you next time.